Ain't no way I could ever post this client on Instagram. You sure about that? Let me show you how to get this done. Let's get it. Since our client is losing his hair at the crown of his head, we're going to give him a bald fade to complement what he's got going on. But stay with me here. You see how I'm angling the bald line from bottom to top? I'm putting it up into the direction of where our client's hair is thinning out. Next, let's cut the top down, cutting it at a length that's going to complement our client's hair. Next, I'm gonna put the clipper in the open position and I'm gonna angle it all the way up into the crown of our client's head, still following a similar guideline from bottom to top, fading right into that crown. Do the same on the other side. Then you'll just meet it in the middle. And now you can see I've just blended in that bald line from the bald to the open. And when you continue that same process, you can take your client from this to this. Yep, I just blended that open into the half guard that I used on top. All the while making my goal to blend in that balding area on the crown. Here you'll see the front. Putting that crispy edge on there makes all the difference. Yes, much of what we do as barbers is an optical illusion. Taking what the client has and perfecting it. Drawing the eye to the areas that we want people to notice. Never underestimate your work.